Opinion, Syrian Civil War, Negotiating in Bad Faith the surge in violence comes as representatives of Syrian President Bashar al-Assad's regime are expected in Geneva on Friday for the latest round of talks aimed at ending the war. Outlining its bargaining position, the Opposition Bloc High Negotiating Committee HNC, said it would be willing to share equally in a transitional council with the government, but repeated its rejection of a role for Assad. Salim al-Muslit, spokesperson for the HNC, told Al Jazeera there was no place for Assad in the new setup. I believe we're doing the right thing for our people, Muslit said from Geneva. The other side, the government, was forced to come here, they don't care about our people. We don't want to see any more fighting and killing. It's important that we find a solution here in Geneva. But there's no place for Assad or people around him who committed crimes in Syria. For us, it's important to have people who care about their own people who deserve to see an end to this nightmare. The latest violence comes as escalating fighting between Russian-backed regime forces and rebels around the provincial capital, Aleppo city, threatens a nearly seven-week ceasefire that had largely been holding. ISIL and other armed groups are excluded from the truce. The five-year conflict in Syria has killed more than 270,000 people and displaced half the population.